Let's begin our ab makeover. Standing up nice and tall, holding on to light weights, and just take a deep breath, bringing in the oxygen equals energy, and exhale out any stress. Again, inhale up, bring the arms up, engage your abs, and exhale, tighten up through the abs, belly button up and in, and release. Great, now just bring the arm up and down. Now really feel it in your abs. Your tummy is tight, that's it, the core muscles are strong. Now add a little lift behind, that's it. Now this engages your abs a little more. Last one, good. Just add a knee lift, that's it. Lift up, now we're working the lower tummy too. Really reach up, that's it. Really feel it, lengthen through the spine. Your spine is your lifeline. That's it, last one, and take it down. Legs apart in a plie position. Hold your weights right here. Go down into it, and let's begin a waist twist. Here we go, and twist, twist, that's it. This is great for that waistline. Lose an inch around the waist, really twist, twist. Keep those hips facing forward, that's it. Great, rotate, excellent, good, keep it going. Two more, last one. Okay, now hold it right here, hold it here. Now press into the weight, that's it. Now just lift your heel and get deeper. Now tighten up through the abs. Pull up and in the pelvic floor muscles, that's it. Drop that heel, lift the other one up. Get deeper, hold it, press, press. Tighten your tummy, tighten through the inner thighs. Hold your heels down and press yourself all the way up. Great, now let's begin in Pilates stance, turning your toes out slightly. Zip up through the inner thighs, arms come up overhead, and we're gonna do a pull down, just pull it down. That's it, pull it down. Is your back nice and strong? You're working the sides of the waist. Great, no more love handles. That's right, trim and slim the waistline. Wonderful, a true body makeover. That's it, last one. Good, hold it right here. Nice, strong arms. Bend the elbows. Now we're gonna do what's called an ab crunch. All you do is bring your knee up, crunch down. That's it. But on this exercise, be very focused on pulling your abs up and in. Zip up those abs, yes. Belly button into the spine, navel in. You got it. Great for the lower tummy too. That's it. Last one, here we go, press and release. Okay, let's come down to the floor. Sitting up nice and tall. We only need one weight here. And now anchor yourself with your heels into the floor. Placing your weight up above, elongating the spine, stretching it up, and we're gonna roll down. Here we go. One vertebrae at a time, roll down. Stretch up and come all the way up. Roll up, take your time, really feel it. That's it, again, take it down. Belly button into the back, that's it. Stretch that arm over. Again, take it up, really reach up. Elongate the spine, stretch it up, excellent. One vertebrae at a time comes down. It's almost like peeling all the way down. Last one, we stay all the way up there. Roll up, roll up, stay up nice and strong. Lift through the ceiling, lift through the chest. That's it, and release. Now just place the weight down and lie on your back. Let's get ready for some oblique toners. Excellent to really trim and slim the waistline. Very focused exercise. What we're gonna do is place your hands behind you and we're gonna crunch up and hold it. Now bring your elbows in. Okay, and now we're gonna do little twists to the side. Get ready, tummy flat. Here we go. And twist. This is holding your waistline in and this is really crunching right here, giving you that beautiful waistline. Looking good. Now for those of you at home, want to take it to the next level, go ahead, elevate the feet. Yes, that's really good. Call this like a can-can, a little twist. Muscle man arms. We got two more of these, come on. Really twist, keep those hips down. Excellent, last one. Okay, good work, Desiree. Just relax your neck and shoulders. Wonderful, take a deep breath, inhale and exhale. Come back up, bring your arms up to muscle man. Ready and twist and twist. Now again, make sure the hips are flat. Number two, belly button down, navel down, that's it. And really feel the rotation so you're getting the sides of the waist too. Legs come up, that's it. Good, now really make it on, come on. Really crunch, good, and twist. Harder, give it all you've got, excellent. 
Last one. That's it, great. And just relax. Now it's time to tone and target our lower abs. Let's begin by elevating both feet. Good. Turning out your toes so you zip up those inner thighs. That's it. We're going to lift and lower. Lift and lower. And lift. That's it. We're now really focusing on the lower part of the tummy, below the belly button. I love this one. And the closer your legs are together while you're pressing your inner thighs together, it connects to the lower abs. So it's so important to really get the whole triangle connection. And that's what this exercise does for you. Really focuses. Two more, come on, give it all you got. Last one, up and down. Okay, place your hands underneath your buttocks to protect your low spine. And let's begin with the split legs. Here we go, and split. Relax your neck here though. Flatten out the tummy. Point your toes, that's it, good. Now for those of you that wanna to go to the next level, chin is up, head is up, that's it, good. You can do it, switch. Switch, pull that belly button up and in. That's it, back is flat, good. Couple more, just like this, just give it all you got. This is really targeting that tummy. Last one, and release. Good, relax your neck, turn your toes out again, and little flutters, scissors, scissors, flutter, flutter, that's it. Again, we initiate the movement from the lower tummy and your inner thighs, because it's all connected. Okay, head and shoulders up. Great, and take it down. Take it down, if you can. That's a little more challenging, but it works. Good, now hold it there, tight, tight. You got it, really feel it. Flatten out that tummy. Flat bellies, good. Okay, take it back up now. Relax your neck and shoulders, and release. Bring your knees to your chest, inhale and exhale and slowly place your feet flat on the floor bring your arms up inhale and as you exhale i want you to twist and rotate that's it for the waistline and lift up and over to the other side twist good great for the waistline i love this one it really works but pull the tummy in let the ab muscles do the work now could you do it with the legs up and twist now head and shoulders up, lift up, and crunch. That's it, good. And really twist. Get your head and shoulders up if you can. That's a little more difficult, but try it. Good, really twist. Got two more of these, really twist. Last set, front and to the other side. Great, and release your neck. Hold your neck, relax, and slowly roll up. One vertebra at a time, let me see that beautiful smiling face and go to the side. We're now gonna start right here on our hand. Bring your elbow down right here, and we're gonna lift our body up, reaching the leg, out and up, that's it, good. Now crunch down, really pull it, that's it. Just lift a little higher, lift the leg, that's it, and bring it down. Working both sides of the waistline. I love this one. Good, last one, now go a little faster, here we go, and reach and pull down, reach out, that's it, work in the waist, excellent, two more, you can do it, last one, okay, and now hold it, reach up, hold it, hold it, great, and come down, let's go to our arm, and plank your body all the way up, leave, leave one leg in front and lift it up, now hold it here, lift up, hold it, Hold it up, 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 up. Great. Can you reach your arm up? Hold it, tone and tighten the waistline. Give it all you got. And release. Let's go to the other side. Set up yourself nice and tall. Stay right here. Lift your body weight up. Are you ready? Just reach it out and down. Keeping that foot, first of all, on the floor. And if you get a little more advanced, lift it all the way out. Great for both sides of the waistline. Excellent, keep it going. Here we go, a little faster now. Down and reach and down and reach. Really crunch into it, working both sides. I love this one. Tone and slim down the waist. Last one and hold it. Oh, didn't that feel good? Hold it, hold it. Good, and come down to the elbow plank. And lift your body straight out if you can. Place your hand behind you and hold, hold, hold. 
Reach your arms straight up. Hold the side plank. Be strong. And slowly come down. Let's turn around, sitting up nice and tall. Hold your hands behind your thighs. Press yourself nice and tall. And now scoop and hollow, that's it. Lean back, now it's really scoop and hollow. Wonderful, lift one arm here. That's it, hold it up, pull your belly button in. That's it, and release. Let's try the other arm, lift all the way up. Really scoop and hollow, zip up those abs. This is really working the deep, small muscles of your abdominals. Hold up, now can you do both? Lift up, that's it, hold it, scoop and hollow, belly button in, in, in. Okay, hands on your thighs, lift up, nice straight back. Now, hold your body, hinge back in a straight position, and now slowly bring one leg up, and bring the other leg up, and now can you do your arms up and out? Hold it up there, stomach in, pull it in. Now can you straighten your legs? Hold it up there, hold it up. Okay, pull your knees in and roll onto your tummy. We're gonna do some great back exercises. Okay, the first one is the plank pose. So hold this position. Now we're working the transverse abdominus muscle, the one that holds your tummy up and in. We're just gonna simply bring the knee in and you're gonna hold it there. Your abs are pulled up and in, keeping your back strong and straight. Shoulders, that's it. And now push it back, extend it up. Now you're targeting the tummy still. Squeeze the buttocks, pull up and in those abs. Okay, switch legs. And pull your knee into your chest. This is now working the lower part of the tummy as well as the transverse abdominus. Shift the leg back, hold it, squeeze the buttocks. Lift, 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 you can do it, it's worth it. It's gonna flatten your belly. Okay, take a breather. Shift your hips back, sit down to child's pose. Relax your low back. Okay, grab your weights. Good, now come down all the way to your tummy. We're gonna work the erector spinae muscles that line your spine. All the muscles right along the back. Lift your body upright, lift, good, and take it down. Now we're really using the back muscles, but squeeze the buttocks. That's very important. Lift up now, lift. Notice your neck is nice and long. Good, now bring your hands up and down. Can you lift the weights up? Whoa, now you're really working the back muscles, taking it a notch up there. Excellent, only one more. Tummy's tight, pull your tummy in too. Okay, bring your arms out to the sides. Bring the weights right there. Lift up your chest, hold it up. Okay, remember your neck is long. There, perfect. Now flutter your feet, flutter little flutters. Squeezing the buttocks, great for the low back, great for the middle back. Really extending the chest up. Neck is long, beautiful. Two more, last one. Take a breather, oh. Great. Now release the tension off the weights. Bring your hands up all the way up to Superman. Ready? Everything goes up. This is the best exercise for the back. We work the abs. Now it's time to work your spine. This is one of the best ones. Okay, take a breather. Shift your weight back. Go up onto your tippy toes. Come all the way up onto the knees, sitting up nice and tall. And let's stretch it out. The first exercise is great. It's a camel stretch. Bring the arm up. Lift it up, good, and lift it over here, hold it. Reach your fingertips down to your heels, hold, hold. Reach back if you can, open up through the chest and twist slightly. Oh, doesn't that feel great? Oh, elongating the spine, stretching through the abs, and now use this arm to push you forward, extending your body. Great, with the other arm, pull it up, pull it up, reach your hand back behind you, Stretch straight back first. And now slightly twist to the side. Open it up all through the rib cage. That's it's great for the whole back, your abs. Hold, hold. And now use your arms, lift up, up. Great, now slowly sit up nice and tall. Bring your leg in front of you. That's it. And extend the arm all the way up. Extend it, that's it. Lift up and turn to the side. That's it, stretch. And now slowly bring this arm all the way down and rotate for the waistline. Working through the waist, stretching out. Oh, I love the stretch. And come all the way up. Let's just switch legs. The other leg in front. 
and come all the way up, elongate the spine, stretch it up all the way up. That's it. And twist lightly. And now reach that hand all the way down to the floor and open up the chest. Open it up. That's it. It's great for the oblique muscles. You did great. And now slowly come back down, sit down nice tall, take a deep cleansing breath, inhale and exhale and give yourself a big hand. You did it. See you next time.